Do on for we last left off. It is time, my friends, for war to break out. Lithuania, Estonia, they don't like us as much. That's fine, man. Declare war, declare war, declare war. Bring war to all of your fronts. Yellow army, you should go on the border with Lithuania, please. Red army, you're going to invade as aggressively as you possibly can. And just fucking zoom for it, baby! I'm gonna go here. Special forces, you're going to go into the middle of Lithuania. And I mean, this, this should be a pretty easy war, if I do say so myself. I would like, uh... I mean, is NATO even going to try? I mean, I know, like, right now, Estonia, uh, Lithuania, and all of them aren't actually in NATO. No, actually, I don't know when the Baltic nations join NATO. But either, either way, they, they ain't going to stop us. Estonia's already dead. Now, the rest of these states, I'm going to tell you, they, they don't got too much longer to live. Submit those demands. Confirm and exit. We're going to take all of your natural resources, please. There goes Latvia. Confirm and exit. Yeah, I'm taking their city here. Our forces in. Our unit from Nepal's returned. You just joined Yellow Army for now. And Lithuania is dead. You love, you love to see it. You love to see it. So, Red Army, you're going to deploy on the border with... Not the entire front like that. Just, just here. I would say I'm pretty happy with that result. Yellow Army, we're going to deploy you to the border with Azerbaijan for now. Thanks, guys, for wanting to join the war, but honestly, not necessary. I mean, actually, we could have probably brought, brought Belarus in. That, that might have actually been... Uh, not necessary, but it probably would have helped us a little bit. Let's fight corruption just a little bit more. And I guess now we got to look at our ideological powers, economic strain. Now, where is weapon market, subject view, occupied territories? Right now, you have know, civilian oversight. Oh, wait, no, we have cores over all of this land. Yeah, so they're not even actually going to rebel against us, you fucking dorks. Let's go. I guess we can then probably put purple to invade Kazakhstan, Kyrgyzstan, Tajikistan, Uzbekistan, and Turkmenistan. Also, world tension didn't even increase. Let's go. Dan Marino prepares new elections. That's cool. Still, I don't think I care, but I still want more points here. I, I mean, I still want to annex Belarus. I guess we can reduce your autonomy. And this would allow us to puppet them. Thing is, like Transnistria, and Sy like Syria, at least I don't want to puppet. Transnistria, I do have a core on you, and Moldova, I've also got a core on you. We have we have interest in these regions for sure. What do you, what do you do? Communism in Europe. Every single country in Europe gains USSR communist funding, which is daily communist support plus five, the acceptance of communist diplomacy plus fifty for seven hundred thirty days, and then the Communist Party. I think in every single country goes up by ten percent. Turkey's effect attacked or influence. Mao's claim victory in Nepal. So in Nepal, I have done a lot for you, okay? I've done a lot. I've done a lot for you. More than you would uh you would expect, I would say. And you need you need 200 political power, right, for the coup attempt? How much money do you need for economic aid again? It's like not a lot, because like you're not a rich country. I'm just gonna keep on throwing more and more points in Afghanistan, being like Afghanistan. The Afghan Northern Alliance you should become my puppet state, and then we can use you and, and kind of sandwich between uh, the Central Asian states. We can, we can rule the world together, Afghanistan. You and me, buddy. Top of the god dang world. I don't know about do any of you have like uh, all of you are basically not doing jack shit. Okay, fantastic. Gonna assign you to Yellow Army, move your way down south. Organization's pretty good. I'll take you. Why not? Can't do these quite yet, because we can't be recent. Unfortunately, we can't get more military aid. Military aid is really, really nice. It, it boosts your points up by quite a bit. 
Unfortunately, you're not at war anymore. As nice as that would be. Okay. Social Democrats have won in Finland or Sweden. I actually did not see where it was. Attack others' influence. How much does it cost to attack, let's say, Iranian influence? 100, huh? One, 100 is quite a bit. Like, it's, a, it's actually a, a ton. A, a bit was uh, maybe a little underselling it, honestly. It, 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 it's a bit. It's a lot. Okay, Caucasian Republics. Let's follow with the Southern Republics next. I don't know why the Southern would be the Caucasus. Or not the Caucasus, in the uh, Central Asia. But who am I to question these things, right? Who am I to question? I'm nobody. Austin's belly. We can declare war on you. Yeah, we just annex all of you, right? The cost of abilities against everyone down here. And you're not defended by anybody. Like, we're just going to declare war on everyone in the region. Declare war on you. Declare war on the small little Georgian breakaway states. Are you independent or are you just like a straight up puppet? Declare war on you as well. There we go. The green army, it's your time to move in. Yellow army, you're going to be moving towards Baku, please. The war in Afghanistan has quieted down. Excellent. Afghanistan, you still like me? 46% influence. And no one else, and another of you are uh, actively hostile towards me. Also, I guess all of you are backing green right now. And that's fine. We should have, like, complete your superiority. I don't think there's anything the AI could actually do to stop our advance. Like, they're just... You're just fucked. Like, it, it's it's so over for you. It's li literally never been more over for anyone else in the history of the universe. Dodo Seta. Thank you very much. Problem is, is that Turkey's in NATO. I would love if Turkey were to leave NATO. I feel like that would be beneficial to us. Yeah, Armenia is down here. 16% world tension. What was the last... Okay, trigger is from me declaring war on basically everybody. Fair, fair enough. But, like, have you ever, you know... Like, shut up about it? Yeah, I want to kill Georgia next. And then all of green can really move their way down into uh, Armenia. Could get some good stuff going there. Attempt coup. I would I would love to. Many today politics gives us a ten percent boost. Georgia is dead. Fifth demands. China shells Kinmen. Further escalation in the Taiwan Strait crisis. China's fire artillery and military installations. Okay. So the United States and China and Taiwan might be going to war very, very soon. Could I somehow exploit that for my own benefit? Maybe. It's possible. But I want to manipulate your politics. I did already. We need more than 40? There's more than 30, actually. And you are... Going to manipulate your politics again. Fuck it, man. I'll do it, I'll do it again. You can't stop me. Red influence. I would love to attempt the coup. Eighty-six percent chance successful. It is no chance it fails. Hey, there we go. Thank you, Afghanistan. Our coup has been successful. Dramatic scene: A regime change sweeps Afghanistan. Let's go, baby! You want some economic aid? Hey, yeah, of course you do, honey. Honey, what the hell am I talking about? You want economic aid? Not for $25 billion, you don't. How much money are you spending, by the way, on the war effort? $18 billion? War's expensive. I don't know if anybody's ever, uh... noted this phenomenon. War is not cheap. Also, can I just sneak my way to Baku? 
Just like sneak my way around Azerbaijani forces. I want to get the Yevren. I'm going to move my units here. I'm going to move you guys here. To me, that just makes sense. You, okay, we have the unit defending Abaku. Which I mean, it's understandable. You know, you just stay here for a second, okay, buddy? You have our planes here. Push in like this towards the Everin. I think you probably can't. Also, I think I want to get more office sectors. Build those just in Moscow as well. Thank you very much. We need to make more money. 68, 63. Unified this back together. Taliban bus bombing kills our citizens. Very, very cool. Let's say, hey, look at you, Switch. Let me join the UN. Yes, give them more guns. Influence their politics a bit more. Afghanistan, you lovely baby. Ukraine wishes to join CSTO. Does that join our fact? I don't know what you actually do because, again, CSTO doesn't exist as a faction anymore. Here you go. You want some guns? They rejected their guns. Ukraine, you piece of shit. Give, let, take my guns. Yeah, I don't, need, I don't need any of my allies in this war effort. It doesn't actually benefit me. Give me more fuel for oil. I want to surround the Baku here. I want you to win the the Everton like this. I want you to win the Everton. Well, who's weaker? Probably actually you. We have, like, such air superiority here, which is nice. If I can kill you and Baku, that might just win us this war. Armenia, I will say, is putting up a lot larger of a fight than I was originally expecting. You know what? Good on you, Armenia. Good on ya. Better air support. Uh, you guys over here are doing just fine. Research. So let's go for... Five rifles. Give me actually, give me, give me a bonus of recon. That sounds fine. Guess we want to go take another city of Azerbaijan. What is this? Well, you're a collaborator. We just need to take like one more tile from uh, Azerbaijan. I think we should win this. It'll take Yevren in just a moment. These units will be surrounded. Is that going to be enough for us to win? Okay, Armenia actually capitulated first. Genuinely, I'm a little surprised by that. We'll take this city from Azerbaijan. That should secure us the victory in the Caucasus. And all that, and we still have like 25 days until we need to... Invade uh, this area of the, of the world. You know what it's called. Ooh, okay. Kazakhstan is large. So you will pull these units away from the Chinese border for right now. We'll put them on the border of Kazakhstan. Get our units deployed. Uh, keep on giving you economic aid. Afghanistan loves it. Again, you're supposed to join CSTO, but it doesn't actually work because, again, CSTO doesn't exist for the Fifth International. Condemned Iranian aggression. I don't I, I don't know what Iran's done that's considered aggressive. I would say, I, if anything, I've been maybe a little bit more aggressive than, than some of these other people around here. Oh, we even got some more uh, units. You guys, uh, tank brigades, go to go join a uh, yellow army. Thank you very much. Okay, Liberia's been puppeted. Okay, so that's actually a war we never even saw. Who, who owns them now? Sierra Leone. Okay. I was going to say, like, that's a war I don't think actually even ended ever in our Nigeria campaign. 
And yeah, okay, you all join yellow then. Which means that yellow can spread their borders just a little bit. And unlike uh, what we did before, we're just going to attack this country piecemeal. I.e., we're not going to clear war on everybody at the exact same time for no reason. You guys are going to deploy. You're going to move your way towards the capital. And while I'm, I mean, I don't know how many troops Kazakhstan has. 11 to 21. Let me just tell you, that's less troops than uh, than are on the Soviet Union. Possibly goes down by 10. Goes down by one. We pay a uh, little bit of money for this. 4.25 for for a synthetic refinery. Synthetic refinery. What does that actually give us? Fuel gain from refineries. Yeah, sure. We'll, we'll throw a little bit of money at that. Not a huge, huge deal. Look how many air bases. Why are there so many air bases in the Caucasus? Put a million of those bad boys down there. Holy hell. It's going to give Afghanistan even more stuff. I mean, Afghanistan's very close to becoming a puppet of ours. Apparently, Ukraine feels threatened. That's why they want the guns. Belarus want the guns as well. I do have a ton of guns. Like, I've got guns to go around for days. Who else are we, who else are we influencing? Afghanistan, Tajikistan, India. Oh, well, sorry about this. We're going to invade you very, very soon. Korea, or North Korea, we're fourth. Ratio, we've got like 0.5%. I don't know how Peru has so much. I'm going to give you uh, some guns as well. How much money do you guys want? 7 billion? There we go. Like, Cuba, I think you should join the uh, our new international. It's a good time, honestly. We're, we're all having a lot of fun with it. Southern Republics. We'll then do communism in Europe. Hi, Kazakhstan. You'll all like me a little bit less, but... I'm not super concerned. Have one of you just go straight to the capital. Iran actually wants to give me volunteers. Like, Iran hates Kazakhstan for some reason. I don't know why, but you know, Kazakhstan actually might get some volunteers from people who hate Iran. That is very, very possible. You've asked for debt bailout, 14 billion. Yes. So we're getting more points here. Seventy-four. Like we're very close. I think like one more economic aid, one more military aid, uh, will get us to where we want to be. Poor Kazakhstan, man. Like they didn't stand a chance. You know what, Iran? Eight divisions. Holy shit. They they really they really hate at Kazakhstan. I don't know what Kazakhstan's done to you. That would make you this absolutely hostile towards them. How close? They're about halfway dead. Kyrgyzstan, Uzbekistan, Turkmenistan, Tajikistan. I can't imagine them being too uh, scary. Let's see if we, I mean, we could try a target. A targeting other people with influence, honestly, it's never worked that well for us. Like, it's never been that good. Korea nullifies their debt. Korea? South Korea also has a cost ability against you. Everybody wants to go to war with North Korea, but they're currently still, uh... Sure, build a... 4th gen... No, we already got... Make an attack helicopter. There you go. You can have fun with that one. Is it, yeah, I don't want to go to a war Turkmenistan, Uzbekistan, or Tajikistan yet. Radical policy shift in the uh, Vatican City. Who rules the Vatican right now? Uh, the Pope. Okay, the Pope. The Pope's back. Military aid. They've accepted. Immediately turn you into a puppet state. 
You're immediately in the inter international. Let's fucking go. Hi, Afghanistan. We have been very aggressive. I don't think there's anybody who's going to be denying that fact. But that's okay. Guarantee independence is accepted by Ukraine. Sure, I don't even know when I did that, but you rejected it. Really? Ukraine, I'm trying to give you free guns. Who, who says no to free guns? If I'm offering them to you, you should just say yes. It's, it's the common courtesy. I don't know why you got to be so weird about it. By the way, Belarus, how are you? 47%? I mean, you're my puppet. You should just... You've rejected it even? My own puppet doesn't want my guns? If I can't give my guns, my puppets guns, who can I give guns to? It's a lawless society out there. Guess you guys will move your way into Turkmenistan. Thank you, Kazakhstan, for falling. Collect all of your territory. Okay, we should be making more money now. You need 390, okay. You guys go around Kyrgyzstan. You guys are going to go around Uzbekistan. How many troops does Tajikistan have? One to three. Clear war. Afghanistan, I'm going to call you into this. But just in the war against Tajikistan. Not, not in your other ones. How much stability gives zero percent stability? Close trade agreement, improve relations, request forces. I mean, people still send intervention forces to Afghanistan. I don't even know why. Invade Turkmenistan. Invade Uzbekistan. Invade Kyrgyzstan. You love to see it. All of you march your way into these countries. And you shouldn't, I don't think, Afghanistan, you shouldn't be at war with these other guys, right? You've been embargoed by Turkey, Spain, United Kingdom, Chile, United States, Netherlands, Argentina, France, Korea, Kuwait, UAE, Mexico, everybody. Look, okay, I've generated some tension, okay? 30.1%? 30, 30 like, it's not... Like, grow up, all of you. Grow, grow the fuck up. Oh, I can't go invading my neighbors. Shut up. What do you what do you know? Been embargoed. Embargo my my ass. Also, I don't think we be are embargoed. I mean, I don't see the embargo uh it's not listed in here unless I can't scroll for some reason. I oh, know, okay, it, it does show here. It doesn't show up on this screen. Maybe I just can't scroll far enough. Like, it just won't scroll at all. So we're embargoed by a few countries. If you have a problem with the way that I run my country, well, then, you, you, you know, th th there's, there are some things that, you know, we could change. But I'm not going to. Been embargoed by Bahrain. Look, I'm just bringing world stability back, okay? You guys just simply do not understand. There's Turkmenistan done. Select all, thank you. Do you guys actually even have an uh, attack plan? I don't actually think they do. I see you take these cities, please. I will say I'm a little uh, disappointed in Afghanistan. They actually haven't done any anything really. Okay, there's Uzbekistan, and we're gonna have three more days until we get communism in Europe. There's Kyrgyzstan. Select all. There's communism in Europe. What do we want? I guess we'll go with the Red Army next. Because now I don't know if I can trust anybody else. They all seem very mad at me for no real reason. The 
Tifa stand, select all. Smithos demands in, confirm an exit. And I mean, the war is now over. We're gonna send you to the border with Turkey. You're gonna go into Belarus to defend this border. Green army for right now. I don't know where else I would send you. I guess we'll just, we'll just keep you uh, keep you near Volgograd for now. That seems okay. I don't know where else I would put you, to be completely honest. Throw you into brown. The non-state actor. And you would accept... Why would you not... Because they need to be communist. Right. And, and they're not... Uh, currently communist. I wish they would be, though. It'd make my life easier. But for right now, I think it's going to be a great time for us to end this episode. Thank you for watching. Please answer with me if you uh, enjoyed. Give a thumbs up. If not enjoyed, give a thumbs down. If you want to see more, subscribe and goodbye.